Good evening. The city can soon check off the final park on a list to undergo major renovations on Oahu's leeward coast. In two and a half weeks, Ke'au Beach Park closes and the homeless living there will be forced out. As KITV for Shane Enright reports, the homeless say they will move west onto state property. More and more tents started popping up at Ke'au Beach Park as a result of the city's effort to overhaul beaches and parks along the leeward coast. This is the city's last stop on a list of parks to clear out and clean up. The homeless are warned it's time to go and are beginning to move out, but are unsure where they will live. All these people, they got nowhere else to go. Ty lives at the park with her four-year-old daughter and husband. She says her family will pack up their belongings before shuffling further up the coast to undeveloped state land. We're already trying to move, but just down to the bush. The homeless say their options are limited. Shelters don't allow animals and many here own pets. Some say rent is too expensive, while others choose this lifestyle. It's not a lifestyle that most people want, but it is a lifestyle that some people choose. I mean, we can't afford the rents here. I mean, if we could, if we could, we would even live in a house. I mean, but if you're working a minimum wage job, you can't afford to rent a house. <laughs> rent's ridiculous. The city says roughly 140 homeless campers, including 20 children, live at the park. Social workers are assisting homeless who will pick up and move once again. We're here because we have nowhere, nowhere else to go. And it's the end of the road. The city initially scheduled the closure for March 6, but moved it to the 8th, giving the homeless two more days to move out. Reporting from KL Beach Park, Shane Enright, KITV4 News. After crews clean up the park and make any necessary repairs, the park will reopen to the public, but it will close every night between 10 p.m. and 5 a.m.